You've got a sphere. Now imagine you've got a sphere. If you've got a flat surface and you're going to put a cylinder and interface the cylinder with the flat surface, conjoin the space, you simply cut a round hole the, the diameter of the cylinder. But if you're interfacing with a sphere, you can't simply cut a round hole and have the two interface, right? Because now, if it's a flat, flat plane, the end of the cylinder is just going to be a flat circle, right? But if you're connecting with a sphere, now what happens is the interface of the cylinder has to conform to the sphere. And what that then does is it creates this edge where you transition from the inside of the sphere to the inside of the cylinder. I hope this is making sense. Hmm. Now, within this machine, you've got whirling plasma vortices that are moving at a very high rate of speed. And what happens is, is you introduce plasma into this device and it coheres and self-organizes into plasmoids. 